After weeks of nearly nightly murders, community and political leaders are hoping this meeting will help identify what they say are multiple solutions that will be needed to get guns off Oakland streets. We're all in this together. It's, it's a it's state of emergency. Attorney General Rob Bonta announcing the state is taking a leading role, touting their new Office of Gun Violence Prevention, the first of its kind in the nation. The office is using data to target gun crime hot zones and expand resources like red flag laws that allow firearms to be taken away from someone who's considered a safety risk. We'll use the bully pulpit in our statewide leadership to encourage others, draw down resources for folks to use, um, share with them a tool that they may not be aware of. The conference, which has been scheduled for months, comes in the midst of escalating violence in the city, including a mass school shooting injuring six people at the King Estates campus and a birthday party shooting that killed two teen brothers and injured two other people. The city's mayor calling on tougher federal gun laws and council to pass local measures to help. We have to do better with what we have. We have to be smarter. I am frustrated that our city council has not passed our vehicle license plate reader policy that would allow us to take advantage of technology. San Joaquin's DA is advocating to educate kids about guns to prevent them from using them. We need to give them the tools and the resources to make better and informed decisions. But it's too late when you see me because somebody's already been harmed. For survivors of violence like Tanish Holland, she believes solutions start with providing support for victims to prevent them from turning into those who commit crimes in the future. If we could do that, we will see a reduction because we're going to prevent more trauma. We're going to create safer pathways for people to move to safety. An effort to address the root causes of gun violence by finding not one, but many solutions. In Oakland, Valina Jones, NBC Bay Area News.